Well, kids, candy, and costumes. For many, that's what Halloween is all about. But for a child with food allergies, Halloween or Halloween can be not only scary, but also deadly. Organizers of this Sunday's spooktacular trunk or treat event say they want Halloween to be fun for all kids. And one organizer, Samantha Godino, says many Halloween events are not all inclusive, like for her son Shepard, who has a severe peanut allergy and carries an EpiPen. That's why this is her second year bringing the Teal Pumpkin Project to Escanaba. The Teal Pumpkin Project offers non-food items to these children who otherwise cannot safely have candy treats for reasons out of their control. So it's just a way for us to make all of the kids in the community feel included and like they can participate safely. Now, if you want to be on the teal pumpkin map for Escanaba, get items like vampire fangs, spider rings, and scary fingers, paint a pumpkin teal, then go to UpperMichiganSource.com or the TV6 Fox UP mobile news app to sign up.